Greetings and welcome to the introduction to astronomy. One of the things that I like to do in each of my introductory astronomy classes is to begin the class with the astronomy picture of the day from the NASA website that is apod.nasa.gov apod. And today's picture for July 12th of 2023 well, it is titled Rings and Bar of Spiral Galaxy NGC 1398. So what do we see here? Well, here we see the spiral galaxy known as NGC 1398. That's its catalog designation. And we can see some spiral arms swirling out from the center. But it does look a little different than maybe some of the others. First of all, it is a barred spiral. And you can see the bar there very close to the center, the yellowish bar going almost vertically up and down through the very middle section out to that inner portion of the ring. Now we also see again it has a ring of stars as well so there could there are rings of stars is here as well and the rings are rather unusual we do see ring galaxies but they're not as common as the normal spiral and elliptical galaxies. We think that perhaps the rings are caused by gravitational interactions that if another galaxy were to collide with this one it could almost cause a splash in it and that would enhance what we call the density wave within the galaxy. The density wave is a bunching up of material. So it's a wave, but it's a wave of density. It's kind of like a traffic jam on the highway. So when you have to slow down to go around, say an oversized truck that is going a lot slower on the highway, it bunches all the cars up there. And there's a, a large number of cars, but they're slowly moving past. So they're continuing to move. And that's what's happening with stars. Stars get slowed down in the density wave where there's excess material and then speed up when they come back out of it. So it enhances that area and makes it more visible. This is what we think causes the spiral arms to be highlighted because that's where the density increases and that's where we see the star formation and therefore the stars, the blue clusters of stars that form will then highlight those spiral arms. Now the blue stars don't live very long so they won't live long enough to move outside of those spiral arms. Now the same kind of thing could happen with the rings. You could actually get material going through and being bunched up there making the uh, the ring stand out as it might not ordinarily so we learn more and more about gal about galaxies by studying unusual ones like this one and in fact this galaxy is 65 million light years away meaning that's not how it looks today that is how it looked 65 million years ago around the time of the extinction of the dinosaurs now what does it look like now well it probably hasn't changed a whole lot even though 65 million years is a long time for us it's not a very long time for galaxies lots of those blue stars have come and gone However, new ones have formed to take their place. So the overall structure of the galaxy probably looks pretty much the same. So that was our picture of the day for July 12th of 2023. It was titled Rings and Bar of Spiral Galaxy NGC 1398. We'll be back again tomorrow for the next picture. So until then, have a great day everyone, and I will see you in class.